In the NBA, no name shines brighter than the King LeBron James of the Los Angeles Lakers. Even before he made the jump from high school to the pros, he was already well known. LeBron is in his 19th season in the NBA and has built a fortune of over $1.7 billion. And according to Forbes, he is also the fifth highest earning athlete in the world, making $95 million a year. But believe it or not, despite that fortune, the Lakers star cannot shake off a couple of cheap habits. In the early 2000s, LeBron James high school basketball games aired on ESPN where his name started to blow up. LeBron was drafted in the 2003 NBA draft and landed with the Cleveland Cavaliers. He spent his first seven seasons of his career in Cleveland going from a teenager to a dominant pro before famously hitting the free agency and joining the Miami Heat with Dwayne Wade and Chris Bosh. After winning two titles with the Heat, he returned back to Cleveland and brought the land their first title ever. In 2016, he then decided to jump once again and leave Cleveland for LA. On the hardwood, LeBron has established himself as one of the game's biggest names, which has made him incredibly wealthy. The King has a total fortune of over $1.7 billion dollars a sizable chunk of that comes from his nba contracts where he's earned just under 307 million dollars in just salary during his nba career but a lot of his fortune does not come from just the hardwood the lakers forward has also invested and struck gold with blaze pizza and even owns part of liverpool fc of the premier league in england those moves combined with his NBA salary and endorsement deals have kept the cash flowing for the king, LeBron James. But despite having that massive fortune, LeBron James does not throw money around like nothing. The king knows how to pinch a few pennies here and there. His former teammate from his Miami Heat days, Dwayne Wade, has shared that LeBron James is the cheapest basketball player who he's ever traveled on vacation with, believe it or not. That's right, apparently King James does all of his texting and emailing within reach of Wi-Fi. He's not prepared to pay for unnecessary data and roaming charges. It may not sound like much or an exaggeration, but LeBron James has even admitted himself that he will not use his phone unless there is Wi-Fi and he will not be turning on data roaming. He also does not buy apps. He still has Pandora with commercials. And that just goes to show you that LeBron James is just like us and looks to save money any way he can.